black hole, an enormous well of gravity in the very fabric of space. But what do we know about black holes? What are they really? They don't exist. If it doesn't say anything about it in this book, then you don't need to think about it. Our vast, infinite universe has been the source of questions since the dawn of mankind. But all those questions can be answered quite easily. The answer is, God did it. In this beautiful white church minivan, we can go anywhere. From the event horizon of a wormhole to the picketing of a Planned Parenthood. We all know God lives in heaven. But what do we see when we look to the heavens? Planets? Stars? Constellations? I see something. A man's face. That man is God. So God is just some old white man with a big bushy beard looking down on us from heaven? Yes. Yes, he is. Mm. But who created the heavens and the stars? God. And why did he do that? Tisk, tisk, tisk. That's not for you to question or know. We know from fossil records that our planet was once ruled by giant, ferocious reptiles. And what happened to them? <clears throat> Nothing. They never existed. Satan put these fossils on Earth to trick you. Did he get you? Don't worry about it. It's never too late to come back into the fold. Satan, you old jokester. Carl Sagan said, we are all made of star stuff. And he was right. But God made that star stuff. We are all made of star stuff. Except for women, who are made from the rib of a man. And what about the sun? God made it. The only sun you need to be thinking about is the holy sun, Jesus. The moon. Man walked on it, God made it. Ants, God made them. Dogs, God made them. Trees, God made them. Gay people, God didn't make them. They chose that for themselves. Cars, America made them, but God made America. Sandwiches, God made them. Everything, God made it. Well, we were supposed to do six more episodes, but we seem to have answered all of your questions in the first two minutes, so we are going to air color bars with subliminal messages for the rest of our time. I'm Jared, Community Outreach Leader of the Creationist Baptist Church of Alabama. Thank you for your time. God bless.